Sundanese cuisine is the cuisine of the Sundanese people of West Java, Indonesia. It is one of the most popular foods in Indonesia. Sundanese food is characterized by its freshness, the famous lalab eaten with sambal and also karatik demonstrate the Sundanese fondness for fresh raw vegetables. Unlike the rich and spicy taste, infused with coconut milk and curry of Manangkabau cuisine, the Sundanese cuisine displays the simple and clear taste, ranged from savory salty, fresh sourness, mild sweetness, to hot and spicy. Sambal terasi is the most important and the most common condiment in Sundanese cuisine, and eaten together with lalab or fried tofu and tempeh. Sayur asam vegetable tamarind soup is probably the most popular vegetable soup dish in Sundanese cuisine. Another popular soup is soto bandung, a soup of beef and daikon radish, and mie kokok noodle soup with beef meat and kikal. Ingredients Fresh water fishes such as carp, gourami, tilapia and catfish are usually either being bakar grilled, or goring deep fried, and usually served with sambal or sweet soy sauce. Sundanese people has developed fondness for salted seafoods. Various fried salted fishes, anchovy, and salted cuttlefish is popular in Sundanese daily diet. The pays or pepes cooking method that employs banana leaf as the wrapper of food is also common in Sundanese cuisine. Among other, pays lock emmas or carp fish pepes is among the favorite pepes dishes. Chicken are usually either fried or grilled, also served with sambal or sweet soy sauce. Bakakak hayam is Sundanese style ayam bakar, grilled chicken. Sometimes chicken also can be made as pepes or soup. Meats such as beef, water buffalo, lamb, or goat can be marinated with the mixture of spices and coconut sugar and fried to make the empal gepuk sweet fried meat, sprinkled with fried shallots. Beef and potato sometimes are stewed in sweet soy sauce and spices as samore dodging. Cow liver and jenkal stinky bean also can be made as samore as well. Goat and lamb meat also can be made as satay in Sundanese style, such as sat marangi. Gulai kambing and empal gentong goat meat and offal curry is also popular soup. If Javanese has developed their fondness for tempeh, Sundanese has developed the fondness for onkam instead. Both are fermented products but with different kind of fungi and beans. Tempeh is from soy beans while onkam is from peanuts. Sundanese has developed the fermentation method to create distinct foodstuffs. Fermentation was employed either for making fermented foods such as onkam, making sauce such as tauko, adopted from Chinese Indonesian cuisine, or sweet snack foods such as puyam which are tapai made from rice or cassava. Sundanese restaurant In Sundanese cuisine establishments, it is common to eat with one hands. They usually serve koboken, a bowl of tap water with a slice of lime in it to give a fresh scent. This bowl of water with lime in it should not to be consumed, however, it is used to wash one's hand before and after eating. Sundanese and Javanese traditional restaurant may feature a traditional dine style called lesian, having a dine while seating on the floor covered with straw or bamboo mat. The dishes may be served on a short-legged table or altogether served on the mat. This dine style is quite similar with Japanese traditional tatami dine style. The Sundanese traditional restaurant in rural village may also feature a song-style restaurant. It features several small eating pavilions that might be built near or over fresh water fish ponds. The fish ponds contains a live fresh water fishes such as carp and gourami, that might be selected and ordered by customers to be freshly cooked immediately. In popular Indonesian culture, Sundanese restaurant often can be easily distinguished by containing the name, Kering, thus led to the terms, Kering, food or Kering. Restaurant. However, this naming was rather misleading, since in Sundanese language the word curring is a common, colloquial, yet rather coarse form to refer first person singular personal pronoun. I or me also as possessive adjective. My. This naming trend was led by restaurants that tried to imitate the famous Sundanese restaurant Lember Curring, Sundanese. My home village. Some examples of famous Sundanese restaurants are Lember Kering, Sari Kering, Song Kering, Ponyo, Boboko, Mang Enking, Ma, Uneh, Sindang Rirat, Dapur Sunda, Bumbu Desa, Laksana, and Impera. 
dishes Nasi timbal, referring to the style of wrapping a cooked hot steamed rice in banana leaf. The heat of hot cooked rice touches the banana leaf and produced a unique aroma. It is made in ways similar to making lontong, compressed, rolled, and wrapped in banana leaves. It then evolves into a complete dish served with various side dishes like fried chicken, duck or pigeon, empal gepuk, jambal roti, tahu, tempeh, sayur asam, with lalab and sambal. Nasi timbal later evolved to Nasi bakar. Nasi liwit sunda, one pot cooking consisting of rice and seasoned with spices like galangal, lemon grass, and Indonesian bay leaves. To further enhance the flavor, usually parts of salted fish are thrown in as well. Nasi tutug onkam, hot steamed rice mixed with roasted onkam, shallots, and kanker, usually served with krupak, sambal tarasi, and anchovy. Lalab, raw vegetables salad usually eaten with sambal Sambal tarasi, mortar ground chilies with shrimp paste Karadik, raw vegetable salad in peanut sauce Lotek, boiled vegetable salad in peanut sauce Sayur asam, sour tamarind vegetable soup Onkam, a type of fermented food similar to tempeh Oncom can be fried, made pepes or stir-fried with vegetables such as ulakutek lunka, selenum nigrum, or oncom pute, green stink bean. Tumis tauko, vegetables stir-fried with fermented soybean paste sauce. Tauko is similar to Japanese miso paste. Tumis konkun, stir-fried of water spinach. Various pepes. Pepes is cooking method employing banana leaf wrapper. Various ingredients could be made into pepes, such as carp, anchovy, tofu, oncom, lunka, mushroom, salted egg, etc. The famous recipe is pays lock emas, carp fish pepes. Various econ bakar, literary means. Grilled fish. Served with sweet soy sauce and chili dipping sauce. The fish could be carp, gourami, tilapia, or catfish. Various econ goring, literary means. Fried fish. Served with sweet soy sauce and chili dipping sauce. The fish could be carp, gourami, tilapia, or catfish. The famous recipe is gourami goring kippas, which is deep fried gourami with flesh spread like a fan. Various econ asin, salted fishes, mostly seafood fishes such as peta, jambal, parai, rays, econ asin bulu ayam, teri, anchovy, and kumi asin cuttlefish, also fresh water gabas, snakehead. Bakakak hayam, Sundanese style grilled chicken. Soto bandung, a type of soto, beef, and daikon soup. Soto mie, a type of soto with rice vermicelli, spring roll, and beef tendon. Mie kokok, a type of noodle dish with beef meat and kikal Sat marangi, a Sundanese style marinated satay usually using goat meat Gulai kambing, goat or mutton meat and offal curry Empal gentong, a type of goat or mutton meat and offal curry from Siriban Empal gepuk, sweet and spicy fried beef Laksa Bogor, a variant of laksa from Bogor Kupat Tahu, Katupat, Tofu, Rice Vermicelli and Bean Sprouts in Peanut Sauce Asinan, type of vinegar fermented vegetables or fruit dish Baso Tahu, Indonesian style dim sum with peanut sauce, also known as Somai Bandung Batagar, Baso Tahu Goreng, or fried bakso and tofu Seblik, stir fried wet krupik with other ingredients. Snacks Sarabi, traditional rice flour pancake in sweet coconut sugar syrup or topped with spicy oncom mixture. Tahu sumadong, fried tofu snack. Tahu gejert, slightly fermented fried tofu snack with slices of shallots, chili, and garlic in spicy sweet sauce. Bala bala, fried dough snack made from various chopped vegetables Sarang, fried dough snack made from sago or cassava flour. Aci goreng, Sundanese. Fried sago flour. 
Tilak, flavored sago balls skewered. ACI de Colic, Sundanese. Hope sago balls. Simil, sago balls snack. Kalenic, roasted cassava with sweet coconut dipping sauce. Dikokal enok, Sundanese. Delicious dip. Lupiat, compacted rice with or without filling, wrapped in young coconut leaf. Puyam Sampayu, sweet fermented cassava. Puyam Ketan, sweet fermented sticky rice wrapped in guava leaf. Kamro, fried dough made of finely shredded cassava with spicy oncom filling. Oncom di Hero, Sundanese. Oncom inside. Masro, same fried dough as Kamro but instead filled with melted palm sugar. Amos di Hero, Sundanese. Sweet inside. Odating, fried sweet bread, some variation filled with banana. Dodal garret, sweets made from sticky rice powder and palm sugar, with added milk, or sesame seed. Kolantong, roasted cylindrical shaped rice crackers with either cane sugar or palm sugar coating. Opak, roasted disc shaped rice crackers. Ranginong, fried rice grain crackers seasoned with tarasi. Kalua, dried fruit marinated in sugar. Ladu, sweets made from part of fine sticky rice powder and part coarse roasted sticky rice grains, mixed with palm sugar then compacted, usually has triangular cut. Drinks Bajigor, traditional hot drink made from coconut milk, spices, pandan leaf, and coconut sugar, Bandrak, traditional hot drink made from ginger, spices, and coconut sugar. Chendal, traditional cold drink made from coconut sugar, coconut milk, and green glutinous rice jelly. S. Dogger, ice cream like dessert made from coconut flesh, coconut milk, puyam, sweet fermented cassava, and pink syrup, rose or coca pondin. S. Goyobad, the Sundanese version of S. Champur, mixed jelly and mashed avocado drink in heavy coconut milk and jackfruit infused brown sugar syrup. S. Durin, ice cream like dessert made from durian and milk. Lahong is a traditional sweet and cold beverages made from the sap of Arenga pinata. See also Indonesian cuisine Javanese cuisine Malay cuisine Manangkabau cuisine Food portal References External links Media related to Sundanese cuisine at Wikimedia Commons